Hello campers and welcome to your Lance leveling video. I have uh, sort of prepared the, this so it goes a little bit faster than normal, but it still takes a bit of time. Uh, when you unhitch from your vehicle, uh, you're going to use the... Uh, <laughs> I forgot the jack for, for getting it off and you have a little orange thing to go underneath it. It's the one that has a circle on it, that's the one that goes there. Um, and you level it front to back and you do that with a level mate pro but you'll see that in a second um this i'm going to go over to level mate pro you can so you can see it it's on the tablet and i did level it i swear but now it's telling me that uh the the front has to go up a quarter of an inch uh let's go ahead and do that just for uh the sake of the video now in this you will probably not be able to see the video I can maybe I can position it um, see the point two five up oh, and see it's going back to zero so it's happy whatever we're gonna go back to this side if you can look at the video or at the uh, screen of your included tablet you can see that it says up 1.25 and it happens to be on the driver's side which is what we're on. So this side needs to come up one and a quarter inches. Before you do this, you need to chalk the high side. And I have done that with the X chalk right here in the wheels. This is the high side of the vehicle. It's only one and a quarter inches. I would not do it, do this for anything less than four inches. The trailer tries to compensate, so it should be fine four inches or so plus it's a long coach and it's only so accurate uh all the stuff that i've got because it's not perfectly flat the coach itself anyway so i have to perfectly position the uh jack right here between the tires because it's the place where it should be lifted and i still need to maneuver it you want to make sure that the screw down here I don't know if you can see me. There's a screw, and the end of this does act as a screwdriver. Tighten it, make sure it's tight. There is a handle. I'm not sure if I can get to, get to where you can see it. There is a handle right here that has to be up. Oh, there you go. See the handle right there? I will touch it again using my three hands, you know. Apologize for the vertigo. Uh, now we're going to lift it. And you just pump to lift it. Let's look at what the Level Mate Pro is saying. We might be able to see it. See, we just went to one inch up. 0.75 inches. 0.5. Oh, yeah. Uh, it's easy to go up. Going down is a very swift and not precise thing. That's for when you're done with it. So we're at 0.25. Let's see that zero. It goes green when it's happy. It's also, it also takes us, ah, there, there we go, it's zero. And it looks like we're happy. So right now we're level. In that case, I'm gonna take, see if I can position it so you can see me do this. I'm going to lock that down, that locks it. Take out this thing, and we are level. <clears throat> because I don't, <clears throat> I don't. This is not necessary. I can now show you what you do when you're done with it. Again, I'm going to reiterate: four inches or more is only when I would employ this. I lifted the handle right there, and I'm going to unscrew the screw and. You're gonna see the thing flex. That's it losing everything. You might have to press down on this to get it out. I don't remember whether I locked it. I apologize. The uh, the lock when you're when you're done, you do that. Then when you want to move, you press up. I don't know if you can see that. Up is moving. Down is locked. 
but I'm still moving it and I'll be taking that out later. So we're level now. Officially. And now we can put down our uh, jacks, our other jacks. There are four of them. Uh, two in the front, two in the back. And we have control right here. Here you're going to see the Level Mate Pro. I'm going to go ahead and turn it off because I'm done with it. It will turn off after half an hour, but you know, my battery. Whatever. Uh, this is the front left, back left, front right, back right. I'm going to extend the front left, and you can see that. See how it says extend? You hear that? And you can see it. Got my handy dandy uh, orange thing for it to go on. You may be a little bit overzealous and press the extend button too much and the uh, tax the motor. If that happens, everything's gonna shut down and it's not a big deal. Just come up here, reset. Another important thing, and I really wanna show this, is the back. The back left has a little bit of a trick to it. I'm going to extend it, but it's not gonna go. It's stuck right now. The way to get it unstuck you take your handy dandy rubber mallet and smack it. It's gonna come down now. I've been trying to figure out how to do that so you don't have to do that, but been unsuccessful. Got your handy dandy mallet. Once you get all of the uh, leveling jacks down, go around and tighten them by hand using this guy. You can see a little thing right here. I'm doing this one-handed. And then you can just hand tighten it. It shouldn't require much. That's just to, so it's really secure. Once you're done with that, take some seven dust. It keeps the bugs out and just sprinkle it anywhere the you touch the ground. It helps for keeping the bugs out. And that's a synopsis. I obviously have only done two of the jacks, or really only one of the jacks, but I think you get the idea.